Hello children. Good morning. Today I am going to teach you a topic from maths. Children, this is your maths workbook. And I am going to teach you grouping. Grouping means a collection or set of things or objects that have something in common. Okay. Now we can form group of things on the basis of their size, shape or color. Okay. Now children, what you can see over here? There are different types of fruits over here. Right. Like this is a banana. This is an apple. Now what is this? Pineapple. Watermelon. Cherry. Orange. Strawberry. Correct. Now this is a set of fruits. What is this? A set of fruits. Now, what are these children? These are different types of utensils. Now, let's see what are they. Spoon, bowl, plate, glass and a pan. This is a set of utensils. This is a set of utensils. Now next, there are so many toys over here. Now this is a toy car. This is a doll. And what is this? Ball. Now this is a teddy bear and this is a drum. Now this is a set of toys. What is this? A set of toys. Now let's see the another one. Now here there are different types of vegetables. Carrot, cauliflower. Tomato, capsicum, potato and brinjal. This is a set of vegetables. This is a set of vegetables. Now next. What are these? This is a sharpener. What is this? Sharpener. This is pencil. A pouch. This is a scale. And this is an eraser. Right. Now, this is a set of stationery. This is a set of stationery. Now, next one. There are different types of vehicles over here. Now let's see what are these. This is a scooter. This is a truck. A car. Now what is this? Bicycle. And this is a train. Now this is a set of vehicles. What is this? A set of vehicles. Now children, what you can see over here? Can you see anything in this set? No, there is nothing in this set. Right? This is an empty set. What is this? This is an Empty set. Empty means nothing. Empty means nothing. Now children, shall we take a quick recap session? Let me see how many of you all have understood the concept of grouping. 
okay now here is an activity for you all now here circle the things that you carry school whatever things you carry school that things you have to circle okay now tell me what is this this is a ruler you carry ruler to school yes so you have to circle it now tell me what is this this is a hen now do you carry hen to school no so you will circle this no you will not circle hen now tell me what is this this is a book do you carry a book to school yes so what you are going to do you are going to circle book now tell me what is this this is a hammer do you carry hammer to school no you don't carry hammer to school right so you'll circle this no you will not circle this now tell me what is this this is an eraser now do you carry eraser to school yes so you are going to circle eraser now tell me what is this this is a toy and you carry toy to school no you don't carry toy to school so you are going to circle it no you will not circle it now tell me what is this this is a pencil now tell me children do you carry a pencil to school yes you all carry a pencil right so you are going to circle okay now children we are going to do a page from maths workbook okay now here what you have to do is you have to tick the pictures given below according to the color key that means whatever colors are mentioned here with that colors you are going to tick that particular thing okay now here you have to tick all the clothes with red color okay and you have to tick all the animals with green color and all the flowers with orange color all right now children tell me what is this this is a pant right and pant is a cloth so which color you will take yes with red color you are going to take pant okay now tell me children what is this this is a flower now for flowers which color we are going to tick flowers we are going to tick flowers with orange color so here i'm going to tick flower with orange color now tell me what is this this is a skirt now skirt is a cloth so with which color we are going to tick skirt with red color okay now children tell me what is this this is a flower now which color you are going to use for flowers yes orange color so i am going to tick flower with orange color now tell me what is this children this is a frog and frog is an animal correct so for animals which color we are going to use yes green color we are going to tick all the animals with green color okay now what is this children this is a flower so with which color you are going to tick flowers with orange color okay now what is this children this is a shirt what is this 
shirt now with which color we are going to take the clothes yes we are going to take the clothes with red color so shirt i am going to take with red color now children tell me what is this this is a crocodile what is this crocodile now tell me what is a crocodile crocodile is an animal right and what color we are going to use for animals correct green color so crocodile i am going to take with green color now tell me what is this this is a t-shirt now t-shirt is a cloth so with with which color we are going to take clothes with red color so t-shirt i am going to take with red color now this is a turtle what is this turtle now turtle is an animal right so with which color we are going to tick the animals yes with green color right so i am going to tick turtle with green color okay understood children now children there is another activity for you all this is cross the odd one we have to identify the odd one in each set and then you have to cross it now tell me what is this this is an apple apple is a fruit what is this pomegranate pomegranate is also a fruit now what is this banana banana is also a fruit right so apple pomegranate and banana all these are fruits now what is this children this is a carrot now is carrot a fruit no it does not belong to the set of fruits so carrot is the odd one right so what you are going to do you are going to cross carrot okay now children tell me what is this this is a sandwich this one a bread slice and this a cake now children sandwich bread slice and cake all these three are eatables we eat them right now what is this this is a juice do we eat juice no we drink juice right so juice is not a set of eatables so juice is the odd one so we are going to cross it now tell me children what is this dog an animal now what is this cat cat is also animal and this one monkey monkey is also an animal and tell me what is this bird is bird an animal no bird does not belong to the set of animals so bird is odd one so what we are going to do we are going to cross it now children tell me what is this this is a slipper right and this is a shoe and this one is a sandal now all these three are footwear right now tell me what is this this is a frock now frock is not in the set of footwear it does not belongs to the set of footwear right so frock is odd one so we are going to cross it now tell me what is this this is a sofa right this one this is a table and this one this is a chair so sofa table and chair these are furnitures right 
what are these furniture now what is this this is a television is television a furniture no television does not belong to the set of furnitures so television is the odd one so what we are going to do we are going to cross it okay now children tell me what is this this is a car what is this this is a bus now what is this this is a truck now children a car bus and a truck all these are modes of road transportation right they go on road now tell me what is this this is an aeroplane is aeroplane a mode of road transportation no aeroplane is a mode of air transportation right so aeroplane is odd one so what we are going to do we are going to cross aeroplane okay children hope you all have understood the concept of grouping thank you children bye bye